өнөөдөр бид энэхүү ухаарал хайрласан тэл бах хурлыг тайлбарлах хоёр тохиолдолоо. 2015 оны 2 дугаар сарын 3-нд Америкийн нэгдсэн улсын Лос Анжелес хотноо айлдсан өөслөд нэгүүсэлтэй бай. Төгсгийг ярьсан нэг багшчинхаа өдрийн тэмдэглэлтэй хэвчин 2 дугаар хэсгийг багш амийн шүтэлцээгээр тайлбарлаж байна. In September or something, yeah. Uh, remember to instruct uh, T and R to and W to take care of uh, our two children and and let them stay in my apartment if they need uh, over there. Yeah. Give them toys, bicycles, etc., books, computer ready to move in. Wow. I don't know. I don't know why. Just something to remind me to do. Huh? I don't think you need to know that. It's a message from the Fifth Council. I'm allowed seven minutes per day maximum to talk to disciples or else. Number one. As number two, driver named T will come within two weeks to help to drive me somewhere so I don't have to drive alone all the time. It's too dangerous. These are the messages, yeah? Number three, I can stay in a hut all the time. Because I was thinking maybe I have to go somewhere else, you know. Number four, I need a big car soon to move away from here. That was wherever I was. Huh? It's a long time already, no? <laughs> Excuse me. There were messages, four messages. During my so-called sleep, my sleep is not always sleep, huh? I communicate and they communicate with me. Because sometimes during the daytime, I have been too busy or was too busy. I didn't get their message at night. They beat me <laughs> to remind me these things. It actually sounds like when you're beeping or the phone ringing or when you have an SMS from your phone. It's not like that, but it has some sound. Yes. So that I like it. Yeah. Sometimes it's different sounds, different time. It depends on from which uh, spiritual level, either from shadows, universe, or from the original universe. There are different sounds. And different departments. Yeah, different departments. They wake me up with different sounds. Sometimes very loud. Sometimes very loud, like a bell or some engine running or... Sometimes it's just music, or sometimes it's just like a, a talking, but it's not not audible, not not word talking, or sometimes singing. Uh, it, it depends. Wow. I often, yeah, I often have to receive this message to remind me to do things or to to solve some of the difficult problems that my mind could not uh, uh, grasp to understand and to uh, diffuse it. Some big problem, you know, in the world or some some security problem for me that I could not catch it in the daytime. All these things I don't always write down. Huh? Mostly I don't write down at all because I have to go and do it right away or I do it. And I thought after I done, I don't write down. Huh? Mostly I write down so how much spiritual merit point or where do I go to sit, that's it. And so, my diary is nothing, really. Oh, that's so fascinating. This is interesting. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> you just know the tip of an iceberg, you know? Many icebergs. <laughs> multi, multi, multi. <laughs> Multiple icebergs. Okay, let's see anything. Uh, Einstein, uh, Einstein, you know, the scientist Einstein is right. His theory can be proved. Whatever I left somewhere, <laughs> it will be brought back to me. <laughs> it's just a joke. Yeah. <laughs> boomerang effect. Boomerang effect. Yeah. Uh, here I just thank the council for helping with my health. A lot of love, a lot of gratitude. 
And that was on 25th of September when I recovered from some bodily problems. Sometimes I just thank them afterwards, you know. Uh, in my mind, no, I did not write down here. Many times they helped me because uh, medicine of the world cannot cure too much bad karma, so they helped me a lot. Yes, Master. Yeah, so that I can continue to do my work here. <laughs> yeah, they are not really kind to me, huh? they are kind to you, to the world, <laughs> to the universe. <laughs> this body is, is a good instrument, has to keep it in order. If it's too much, then it will kaput and cannot be used anymore. And it takes a long time for me to reincarnate again or to take up some body. Uh, it has to have some affinity. Ah, yeah, it's complicated. Right. Uh, now, 29th September, what is here that I wrote in red? Even? Ah, remember to instruct relief in Pakistan, Japan, etc., etc., uh, 2nd of uh, October, what is it here? Oh, be careful, be much more careful. Too much work, forget easily. And come to the appointment too late or too little. Meaning spiritual appointments, hmm? yes? Yes. Connected too early, I forgot, my God. Sometimes I forgot what time it was. So I have such a terrible, terrible headache. Oh, and shortened. Uh, so the time has been shortened instead of nine and a half. Now it's only seven. Oh, because I made mistake that day to go to the appointed uh, spiritual connecting point. And then I got terrible headache. Uh, but I'm better, uh, quickly. Yeah. I have to, and then I have to recover afterwards. I have to meditate a lot to recover the, the cells and the body and the brain cells, etc. Because uh, there are certain times, I have to explain more so you understand. I, I understood as I wrote that, but you probably don't understand, right? Can you still hear me? Yes, we can hear you, Master. And now and then you have to say yes, yes or no or something. <laughs> I know you do that. <laughs> You're so quiet, I can hear the pin drop. It's like this. Uh, there are certain times of the day that I have to go to the appointment with the spiritual connection because there are many. I probably wrote it down somewhere. Here, it is. Like 128, ka means glasses, glasses in the Oscar always stand by for me at that connection time, you see? Yes. Wow. So I have to uh, keep my appointment, and there are certain times I have to do that. It's, every day is not always the same. Sometimes slightly different, sometimes much different. And that day... Of uh, October of 2014, I had forgotten that point in time um, because I didn't have my alarm clock uh, phone with me, and I thought it was the time to go. That's why I made that mistake because I was too busy, was too busy, too busy, and the uh, the other thing, and I had forgotten. I was very. Uh, I should not have forgotten because it could be dangerous. Luckily, the gossip closed it quickly, and then uh, we had to redo it. But then, uh, you know, the damage was done and uh, uh, the time was shortened. Yeah, like the time was cut short so afterwards. Like if I have to meditate nine minutes, then I can only do seven. Understand? Oh. Yes, master. I can be late, maybe ten, fifteen minutes but not later, or earlier, not earlier, not later. Understand? Yes, yes Master, I understand. Uh, here on the October 2, October 2nd, as we wrote again here, I invent something. <laughs> oh, 1,000 millions of mg, 
you know, MG mean millions of gazillions of gazillions of gazillions already before that, yeah? So 1,000. <laughs> Otherwise, I have to write too long, you know? So I invented new one. Yeah. 1,000 million MG is equal to 1 BG. <laughs> so that instead of write a lot, a lot, a lot, I just write 1 BG, 3 BG, 2 BG, you know? Yes, Yeah. Even then, on the 3rd of uh, October, it's like 3 BG of gazillion of gazillion too has been passed and cared for. Wow. Wow. It was October. And the way that, uh, uh, on the 4th, on the 6th, of course, continue meditating and a lot, a lot, a lot of meditation and a lot of BG, gazillion, gazillion. I don't read that to you, yeah? But you know, okay? Yes, you know yes, that, uh, yes. yeah. Every day I write down how much BG or MG of gazillion, of gazillion too I have done, I have passed, I have cared for, etc. These are just routine, so I don't read it to you. Okay, on the 6th of uh, October, a Harley, after so long, because I had to leave for a long time somewhere else to meditate, after so long, uh, when seeing me, Holly was emotionally and bodily shaking. When saw me again, he became better right away because somebody reported to me that Holly was was ill. You know, he was shaking, shaking, and continuously shaking his body, shaking, and then he had fever and he had cough, and uh, he was very uncomfortable. So I had to run back. Huh? And when he saw me again, he he was shaking the heart. I had to put my hands on him and hug him and tell him that I love him and that everything will be okay. And then he very immediately, right away, I wrote, second, yeah, second's gone, fever is gone, cough gone, and he rests in my arms so peacefully. Whew, I said, dog can be so dramatic sometimes. <laughs> But because sometimes I cannot uh, have them always with me because of meditation and because they're old and uh, they cannot always run up there with me. So I have to think, here I wrote, I must do something because they are getting old and difficult climbing stairs. Must do something. And then next next day I told the assistant to carry him, carrying him up and down the stairs. So it's okay. They can still see me a lot more in the upper upper level because my hut is on the upper level yes, and they live on the lower level. That's why. Okay, but it's okay now. I arrange everything and they're happy. Wow, that's good to hear, Monster. Yeah. On the seven, okay, three dogs can be in new office downstairs where I can come often to see them. Got to arrange my day to be with them. Some day different, some day, you know, different, different things. Uh, 9 of October, what is here? Uh, be, uh, be dog means big dog. Big dog means good love. Yes, yes, master. Big dog is well <laughs> today. Okay. I don't know why I wrote all this. It's something I wrote, I cannot read now, I'm sorry. Something snack. Uh, ah, snacks for dogs, and uh, also, okay, okay, <laughs> there's nothing to do with you. <laughs> Sorry about that, because I couldn't read it, I thought there's something big deal, it's nothing. <laughs> well, what is it? Oh, on the 10th of October, 2014, when working, walking in the dark, is it something for the one to avoid neighbors or bad people attention, I feel comforted to know that I still can see in the daytime and other nights also when safe. Poor blind people, what all they have to endure all their life, how they cook, how they wash, how they go about their business, so much full of sympathy for them. 
I don't know if it was anything for you, but it was there and read it. It's almost repeated, so I will write it again next time. <laughs> I forgot that I had written it before. Because often, you know, I have to walk in the dark at night yes, and to feel my way around. Yeah, because sometimes some spiritual connection are in very inconvenient and exposed place. And I cannot uh, draw attention to myself. So I have to walk in the dark and feel my way and feel my things around and do things just like the blind people. Because when I do things, I cannot hold the light. I will say, I don't have this uh, uh, high-tech telephone that has a flashlight on it. I can still use this old-fashioned Motorola phone, which I can text, I can receive messages, and I can call, and I can receive calls. That's, that's about it. That's all I need for now. And uh, if I hold the phone, then I can have the light on the phone. But when I'm doing things, then I cannot keep holding it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. And the light will turn off by itself after a while, and I don't even see where the phone is. I keep fumbling around to oh, look for my phone to turn it back on. <laughs> by, by that time, you know, it's, it's, I thought, never mind. So much time, I just do it, everything, in the dark. And it's functioning well. <laughs> it's not all that bad, but I don't think I can cook and do everything not all, not all things in the dark, though. Uh, so I have to arrange to do everything, most of whatever I can in the daytime. So nighttime, I don't have to come moving around. Sometimes I fall down and hurt myself. Oh, no, 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 Please be careful. Yeah, because I'm not used to, <laughs> not used to with this situation. And some new places, the things are everywhere. Anyway, no big deal, no big deal, no big deal. And it could even happen daytime also. You know, the other day after talking to you and then after contacting a Shihu for some business regulating the prices, I normally don't take care of the business. I, I just let uh, everyone else take care, you know, whoever take care of their business. Just like in uh, SNC, you know, San Martin Center before. I say you have to bring it down to the minimum so that the poor people can also afford it. And even poor people, you don't charge them. You just give them free. And if some people who cannot afford or can afford less, then you just reduce the percentage. People are under this kind of thing. And also I have to contact some centers for some of their, you know, local problems. So that I fell down and hurt myself. Oh, I... Gosh. Luckily, it's not too bad, and afterwards, I, I have to try to heal myself and recover myself. I worry the, the head concussion, you know, not, not about the pain or anything. Yeah, but luckily, I guess it's no problem. I'm still here and talking to you clearly. That, that means <laughs> the brain's still okay, right? Thank <laughs> goodness you're all right. Yeah. So it happened in, in the broad daylight. Yeah, so it's not it's not because of the, the, the darkness, you know? Okay? Not always. Yeah. But I'm more adept now with walking in the dark. <laughs> it, yeah. I'm very proud of my improvement. <laughs> very proud of my ability to uh to use no light. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if I should read this to you. Let me ask you. On the 11th of, of October, I wrote that total peace could be more or less in three and a half years. Wow, but uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> After talking to you, I'm not sure. You pray for it, okay? Okay, uh, you pray, and then I will pray also, okay? Yeah, yes, I will. Definitely pray. I try, I try. A human has to change also, you know, oh my God. If they change, she should be immediate. So it is, I have to work all by myself. Uh, they're too slow. Okay, October, what year? October 13. Wow. 
It's a Monday. What did I write here for you in the square, you know? Very obvious here. Or to have been cared for and empowered. Wow. Those who were ready, those who were ready has been empowered to quicken to maturity. Thanks to all love and support. Thanks to you. Love you all forever. Love, love, you know, hot, hot. Enough for now. I need a rest. <laughs> I need a rest, I said. Uh, but today, I celebrate in my heart the improvement of the entire universe. Feel relieved, even physically, mentally, emotionally, psychologically, feel relieved. Gazillion of gazillion of gazillion of uh, incountable, you know, of gazillions of etc. 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 Uncountable have matured into full bloom. Full bloom. Oh, wow. Full bloom. Amazing, Master.